All right, we're back in Skyrim. I believe we finished a Legion quest. So next up on the docket, I think we're hunting down a bandit for the Executioner. After we get back the blind Imperial's uh, hat. So might knock out a few birds with one stone depending on our backpack space. So uh, let's get to it. Yes? Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Come back to bits and pieces anytime. Ah, welcome to take a look. Don't forget me next time you need herbs and potions. Oh dear. Need something for a potion? Come on in. Let me know if you need anything, or take a seat by the fire and I'll send someone over. What do you need, my friend? Now you can say you've met the most ah, talented yet another new face. I'm from Hammerfell, you see. We should have the I can festival keep track of all the people Don't I've been meeting. Don't forget the old ready for the best daughter keeps me fed. Yes. And my working days are Take done. Take a look.
you should speak to my Very daughter, well. Yvette. She's the brains of the family. Another quiet day, I hope. Steward, when is my appointment to meet with General Tullius? There are some issues we must speak about. I'm afraid he's had to reschedule, my friend. By all accounts, waiting Steward, for... Steward, I have an idea that might help to bolster the morale of our people in this difficult time. I think we shall have a grand parade and let General Tullius march his troops from the Blue Palace to Castle Dower in all their finery. What a fine idea, my darling. However, I would suggest you wait until uh, the war has ended. After all, the General needs his soldiers out in the field, fighting battles against the Stormcloak. I must protest, my yard. A parade would make you an easy target. Very well. I can see there's no change in your stubborn Nord mind. But when this war is won, I will have my parade. Yes, my yard.
Take a look. Vampires are clever hunters. More clever than you, definitely. Steward, when is my appointment to meet with General Tullius? There are some issues we must speak about. I'm afraid he's had to reschedule, my grace. By all accounts, waging war takes it every moment. Again? He can't simply cancel an appointment with the Jarl. I'm afraid he can. His authority comes from the Emperor. Do you also serve? He uses all of Hafengar's resources, and doesn't answer to me in the slightest? This hardly seems fair. Fair is a word rarely applied to politics, my grace. I'm afraid you must learn to accept this. Sorry. Hey, watch it. Hi, Solilus. Solitude is best city. Well, you're at the uh, right place for that, although um, I do do a few <coughs> ventures forth, but it's the only city we're staying at, and the only reason we're taking adventures out of the city is to complete some of the quests. So we're going to help Noster get his helmet, the uh, half-blind Imperial Scout guy. Um, but we're going to go fast, so let's get Windwalker. I 
And we've also uh, done the uh, start of the Bard College, helping the Jarl, um, Imperial Legion. Uh, about 1800. Uh, it's it's actually a all-in-one mod list through a uh, program called Wabajack, and uh, I did unfortunately take the one with the most uh, graphically intensive, and I just I don't know enough about the settings to tweak them to improve performance. But it's definitely playable. It's just certain weather patterns are a bit rough. Sure. Um, the mod pack is called Row. Um, so if you look in, uh, it's, yeah, it's just called Rose. R-O-S, I think. Um, so if you're in, if you're in Wabajack, um, you, you'll find that mod list. And it, you know, as long as you have a Nexus, uh, account to log into, um, probably want premium. It, it, it took it about two hours or so with a high-speed internet connection to pretty much do the entire thing. There's almost no... A lot of these pre-made mod lists, you still have to do like 50 different tweaks to get it up and running. Nope. I was playing it the next day. So, it is pretty incredible when I think about it. Because I've sometimes spent um, literally weeks uh, getting mod lists ready, you know. Ooh, who are these guys? Move along. Taking this man to be interrogated. By Imperial law, banning Talos, we have the right to do whatever we want. And now you'll walk away if you Does know Does it have an interesting third-person fighting? Um, so I'm, I'm mostly fighting with fists and a little bit of spells. Imperial bastard. Um, the AI does seem to be slightly You're different, where you kind of... All right, hand over your valuables, or I will gut you like a fish. So I've got pretty good speech craft, but first I'm going to intimidate him, then I'm going to attack him. Well, I, I can see you're not one to be trifled with. Let this be a warning to you. Oh, he's just running. I'm on your side. Watch it. Uh, was he unkillable? Because I took that speech pattern. If you provoke me, I will be forced to unsheathe my claws. What are you doing? Hey, be careful. What are you doing? I guess he's invincible once you uh, go through that dialogue. Uh, I guess we could pick a fight with the Thalmers. Damn faithless. Oh man, that wasn't how I wanted to do that. I've got a lot of uh, movement speed perks, so I'm mostly relying on moving very quickly. I don't have any of my buffs up either, so that's also bad. So let's get Oak Flesh up. So we got Oak Flesh. Let's get Oak Heart. And let's heal ourselves real quick if we can. Okay, back to fist fighting. Oh, God, someone summoned the elemental. Oh. God. Uh. Yeah, it's been a while since I've played, so I'm not entirely sure how uh, good the fight mods are, but it's mostly a graphics overhaul, if, so that's probably why. But it did feel different. Um, just not super different. Might try something with better performance on the next playthrough. Because, uh, uh, sometimes this lag is just driving me nuts. It's pretty good in dungeons and when it's not raining or snowing. Nulvis, huh? Okay, cool. Yeah, I might run that for the next playthrough because I think... This one's still going to take a while, because Solitude has so many good quests. Um, but I think I might do... I'm going to stick to City... Like, I'll be honest, I've never done a, a ton of quests. I, like, I've never joined the Imperial Legion. I've beaten the game. I've never done, like, uh, a lot of these, like, big, long, branching quests 
that uh, involve the Stormcloaks or Imperials. Um, the Jarl quests, I I haven't like gone deeply down the Solitude Jarl quest line or like unlocked the house in Solitude. Yeah, I'm having fun with it. I, I, so I did the first, uh, the very first Imperial quest. That's it so far. Um, I've done the in the Bard's College too. I've never done the Bard's College, so I did the intro quest, the very first step of that quest. In fact, actually, let's see the results. Um, so this is the fort that I had to. Um, clear out for the Imperials, so let's see if they've got their garrison there now. Or if that's not taken effect yet. Oh yeah, they're there. Cool. Now that's cool. Everything's in order. See, that's nice. My father was Legionnaire, and his before the Stormcucks. <laughs> when I first played the game, you know, 15 years ago, I joined them. But the more you learn about the game, the more you realize Ulfric's kind of a dick. And like a huge racist, so it's like, yeah, I kind of like the Imperials better. It's like, it's not really, <clears throat> I don't really feel like either faction is perfect, but I think the Imperials are making more sense, uh, for sure. I'm curious if they have a merchant here or not. Keep your guard up. Doesn't look like it. Let me just check inside the fort. Yeah, they're not as bad, for sure. They definitely, you know... Well, and that's the thing, too. When you initially join the Stormcloaks, it's like... It seems impossible not to sympathize. Like, yeah, I was just being executed by the Imperials, so... Of course I don't want to join them. Um, but, as yeah, you know, you play through more, you learn more about the factions, and you're like, yeah, I don't like... You know, I do not like the Stormcloaks as much. Maybe if you could kill Ulfric and take over the Stormcloaks... <laughs> But yeah, so I think it'll be really cool to progress that Imperial quest line, uh, the Bard's College. Um, the first quest was kind of cool. You just go clear out that tomb, and then you make up some BS for the verse. Um, about to do that burning of King Olaf thing next. Um, but what I'm trying to do is uh, just take like one step for each chain, you know, and then I go to something else, and then I come back to it. So. Um, so I did, uh, like, Jarl, Bard, Imperial, and now I'm doing, like, some of the side characters. Oh. Jesus, dude. Oh, uh, I probably don't want to screw with these guys. Um, this looks bad. This might be... Jesus. Whoa, these guys are fast. Ooh. No, no, no. Let's not. <laughs> Let's run. Uh, I'm sure one day I can take on these snow bears. Oh my god, they're so fast. Oh, I oh he's dead. Ooh. Should I help him? Do we do the Pulp Fiction thing where we help our enemy? Because we don't want to see him get chewed apart by bears. <laughs> uh, what difficulty? I don't even remember. It's not too high. Uh, it's on expert. So expert, yeah. I think expert... I don't think I ever play below expert. I typically play on expert. Which which is usually fine for most encounters. And I think it probably makes sense to me that the bears are hitting pretty hard. Because... Oh, yeah. No, it, it definitely is. Yeah, they're, they're really tough. But I'm also wearing light... I'm a, I'm a light armor specialist, and I don't have a shield. Um, and my I don't my enchantments are pretty weak right now. Um, I could have had stone flesh up, so we probably need to put that on. That'll help. Let's get our oak heart back up. Let's show them how we... Let's, sh let's show these bears how to really fight. <laughs> Yeah, I can punch too. Oh, okay. Nope, 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 nope. Let's go. Let's go. These are way too strong. <laughs> Usually that power punch would just jack them up, you know. But uh, that that was not the case there. Yeah, so, you know, I, I, I treat that as... Um... Now I can fight this dude. See, he hit really hard, but so did I. So that felt more of a reasonable exchange. Um... 
I think I have the thing off where my party member can die, which is fine. Oh, that guy—that guy's gonna be tough. Hold on. I'm gonna save this because I'm probably gonna die. <laughs> If I remember correctly, these snow leopards are real. So does this mod pack have the custom skills? It does have some custom skills, it does, yeah. Um, so I've got the whole unarmed, uh, oh my god, dude, get off me, you stupid leopard. Good god. Uh, some of the spells are definitely not from the base game. Um, what else? I've got a, like, aspect of the bear I can enable where I drain my mana to f apply bleed on my unarmed attack- or my, you know, my attacks. Um, but sh just to kind of show you, um, so, like, yeah, you can see where Smith and, uh, I, I, like, there's, there's, I believe these are significantly different from standard, some of these. Uh, like where your armor weighs nothing, you move 10% faster and jump 50% higher. Like, I think that's a little, I think they like streamlined a lot of skills, put more things into a single skill. Um, cause I don't think there was like silent spells or sneak attack spells in the base game. But, you know, I, I have less ex experience with Skyrim after, um, each update. I kind of lose track of what, what is actually included. So that throws me off. Um, but yeah, if I remember correctly, I don't remember if they had unarmed skill tree at all, to be honest. Maybe they did. Um, but yeah, I'm focused. I, I don't like how much emphasis there is on um, power attacks. Because, like, power attacks are awkward to me because there's such a long wind-up for the animation. So I like stuff like this where it's like, yeah, unarmed attacks are faster. So I can just do the quick jab punches, and it's just like, Super fast. Unarmed was never a base game thing. Oh, yeah, so see, I, I love stuff like that, you know. I love playing unarmed. It's just a cool way to play the game. And, uh... Just because I've already played... I've beaten the game before with two-handed, and... I wasn't too big a fan of the base game spellcasting system. It just didn't really excite me. I think it was... I don't know why. It just didn't... Ooh. So he was just a little glass cannon leopard. We had the enchantment for it, but there, yeah, so there wasn't like a skill tree. Exactly. Who's this guy? Well, hey, that's not something you see every day. What, a snow leopard? Oh, good grief. Well, it's getting pretty dangerous to get here. Hopefully, uh, the hand in a Nolvis. Sweet. Yeah, because kind of the goal of this playthrough, I've seen some of those One City challenges on YouTube from some of the streamers, and I was like, that looks like so much fun, you know? Because a lot of the game of Skyrim to me is not... Like, when you start to travel to a bunch of cities, everybody starts to sound the same because of the voice actors, and it's like, a lot of the quests I don't want to do, and you just have to do them when you do the main quest. It's like, just sitting in solitude doing these quests, it's really chill. I'm, I'm having fun with that, so... Huge fan of uh, this way of playing. And I'm learning a lot more about the city. And it's like, by doing all these quests, um, really getting the full experience of that city. Makes the game feel so neat. Yeah, I'll definitely use that uh, mod pack on the next one. No doubt. Alright, so I think that's... Is that the cave? I don't think so. What is this? Pine Frost Tower. Pine Frost Tower, that sounds familiar. Is that a quest? Kill the leader of Pine Moon Cave. Um, we gotta be careful, because one of these quests is vampires. And we're gonna definitely not want to take on vampires with our current setup. <laughs> okay, there's the burrow. The quest from the headsman guy. Yeah, it, that might be it. Um, but I don't think that's the quest location for that. It's just similar name. But good call. Yeah, the headsman, we got to do his quest too. So depending on how much gear I pick up here at Rhyme Rock, we might go to both. Oof. Oh, jeez. Okay. 
Um, exactly. Yep. That's right. Yeah. I just don't know if that Pine Moon Tower is the same. Okay, cool. We made it. Oh, and I've got some reduced fall, falling damage stuff with this. Uh, oh, and there's another thing. So this also includes something called a... Oh, now my favorites aren't coming up. Oh, I can't see any of the UI. Are you kidding me? I think it thought I died. I think that's what happened. Hopefully it fixes when we load over. I'm telling you, the, the one problem with such a giant mod list... Okay, we're back to normal. Let's see if we can do the d extended cast. Don't have enough magic. Damn. Is there's a lot of bugs with... Uh... Also, this... I have uh, had a notorious amount of crashes at certain parts of the city, so when I'm trying to like steal stuff in an empty house. Um, all right, so we've got our armor, we've got oak heart on. Let's get some candlelight. Cause it, with these uh, graphics mods, it's really dark. Okay, and she's got the torch. All right, let's rock and roll. Let's get this man's helmet. Surely there won't be bandits or monsters in- okay. Ugh, great. What is this? Necromancers? That's just an elemental by itself? Well, I have a feeling this guy's gonna be pretty difficult, but let's just go ahead and deal with him now. No way around it. You've made a grave mistake. Ice heart. Damn you! Okay, he felt that one. Damn you! Damn you! Oh, what killed me? Did he explode when he died? That was weird. Please don't crash. It didn't crash. Wow. That's good luck. Okay, so let's try this again. Stone flesh, check. Oak heart. And we will make sure. Oh, hey, Envy. Good to see you back. Welcome to our uh, solitude city and city quests only. So, right now we're picking up the blind man's hat. I think he leaves an ice track on the ground. You could be stepping on it. Yeah, I definitely could be. I, have a, I am very low IQ at Skyrim monster knowledge. All right, so what, but what I am going to do is I'm going to do this. He's going to attack my teammate, and I'm going to punch the hell out of him. There is a caster up here. What is going on? Oh my god, just die. <laughs> oh boy. Um, let's do a quick... Let's do a power heal. Oh, I got the mana. Okay. Well, Mr. Elemental, we seem to be at a impasse. Nothing else? What happened to Morrowind? Oh, jeez. So that was before I changed my computer over. Uh, I went through that huge modless envy, and it just... Um, the whole thing was like broken, so I'd spent like those weeks setting up that mod list for nothing, basically. <laughs> so I, I haven't had the um, the energy to go back to it. Um, luckily, this Skyrim mod list was all in one, so it didn't take me long to set it up. So that was good. Um, so I'll be doing this one for a while because I'm switching between this and I'm almost to Diamond Rank and TFT. And what else am I playing? Oh, I'm playing a little bit of Diablo 4 right now on my Sorcerer. I, I will eventually be doing Oblivion, but I really want to get back to that Morrowind, uh, that open Morrowind huge mod list with this new computer. I'm actually getting my new computer monitor and graph. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be, <laughs> we're gonna have a big graphics card upgrade. Uh, I'm talking like a 4090. 
I saw you on D4 when I was on the other day. Yeah, yes, yeah, so I've been uh, leveling my Sorcerer with the Flame Wall build, Firewall, and I will be switching to uh, uh, Ball Lightning soon. Ooh, where's he going? I like these Astral Blasts because I'm playing a Monk, so I like to think of it as like a Key Blast because it's a restoration spell. I only use restoration and alteration as uh, spell schools, like a self-imposed, uh, like mystical monk type character. Okay, let's outsmart this guy with our movement. Oh, that hurt. Wish I could block for real. Ooh. Ooh, that hurt. Okay, okay. Let's take our time. Ooh. Gotta play it cool. Why am I, am I moving slow? Nope, okay, we're back to normal speed. That's good. He felt that punch. How you doing over here? What's our next move? I'm just pondering the meaning and purpose of life. What else would I be thinking about? Something interesting? So this is the uh, orc uh -huh. rider that was in Solitude's uh, inn. Uh, she gets hurt a lot, but uh, she's really cool. I like, she's very, um, I don't want to say cynical. Uh, just more interesting than Lydia, so. All right, and then the, you know, the, the, the typical ones. Just a cool voice actor, I guess. Um, right, let's save. That wasn't too bad of an encounter. A couple of close calls, though. Oh, yeah, there's 1,800 mods on this uh, mod pack. If you, if you download Wabbajack, it's an all-in-one. And I'm... With Nexus mods, if you have a Nexus mod subscription, it literally took, like... It downloads every mod from uh, Nexus Mods, everything, and it just installs it in the correct order. Everything's pre-configured. I mean, you're good to go. It downloads everything, and you're done. But I don't recommend this mod list. Um, now, I don't have a Bleeding Edge graphics card right now. I've got a 2070. Okay, but that's still an 8 gig graphics card, and it struggles often with the weather in this mod list. When it works, it, it's great. When it doesn't, it's choppy. I don't like that. And that's what I liked about Morrowind, is you could really crank the graphics up. And it takes a lot of... It, it was a lot easier for me to manage the performance. This one, I'm kind of, Oh, there's his helmet! Okay. We didn't take up too much inventory space, so I think we can knock out one of the other quests while we're here. Uh, maybe... Uh, we can help that executioner with the bandit that escaped. So, I didn't think that would be that easy and fast. So that was easy. That was a freebie. You know what? I think he's. I think it is Pine Moon Cave. Yeah, that's that's the one for the executioner. Uh, we'll, we'll we'll return Noster's helmet after we do that because while we're out here in the the boonies, I'd like to make less trips back to Solitude, so that I'm not going to Solitude then running back out. I, you know, I, I feel bad that I even have to leave Solitude, but I just think it's a lot more interesting to to do the Solitude quest than to truly be trapped in only the city. Pine Moon Cave. Okay, so that's one of the quests. We could also do Kill or Capture the Bandit Leader at Orphan's Tier, but I have a feeling... Just clearing one of these is probably going to fill my pack. So let's do, let's do Orphan's Tier. Because... I think that's a bounty, and that'll just get me some more favor with the Jarl. 
maybe? I don't even know if that matters. It's probably just a radiant quest, but let's just do that one. Then we'll then we'll help the executioner out. All right, it's running pretty good right now, and uh, yeah, with oh yeah, I was gonna. Sh uh, Destiny is another skill set, so every five levels, um, I can pick kind of like an archetype skill that's separate from your normal skills and has its own skill points. Uh, the ones I have chosen are Endurance, your stamina increases by... Did I take this one? I must have. No, I did not. Okay, yeah. Um, stamina regeneration, 10% faster movement, which is a Thief Keystone. Uh, power attacks increase your attack damage by 20% for 6 seconds. So that's like an attack damage buff, but I don't... I hate power attacking. I still do it accidentally all the time. Uh, Acrobat, your attacks are 15% faster, which I love that one. Um, I think I'm going to Trickster, because you get a flat 10% chance to evade attacks from weapons. But uh, more importantly, Saboteur kind of stacks with this um, attack speed hand-to-hand -hand fighter I've created because your attacks have a 15% chance to stagger, which will increase my damage 25%. So I spam quick jabs with my fist and stagger them. And then I'm going to deal bonus damage, so it's perfect. Uh, it's basically going to stun them. Well, probably not permanently, but close to it. Alright, let's hit up Orphan's Tier. And yeah, we're really fast, because then we've got the movement speed uh, bonuses from... Uh, the regular skill tree as well. So I, I don't know what the total number is up to, but we're pretty fast. Ooh, gotta be careful jumping off them cliffs at that high speed. Even with safe fall. Oh, found somewhere else new. That's cool. But I don't have a quest for Steep Fall Burrow, so we're not investigating any places that aren't part of a, a Solitude quest. But it's good to have it marked, because maybe it will be part of a future quest. Alright, looks like we're getting pretty close. Oh, watch out for the walruses. Ooh, Nern root. Definitely want that. Ah, uh, there's the ship. This is probably where the bandits are. Alright, let's lay low. Never know when you'll find a, uh... I'll be honest, I'm a little confused with this location. Okay, that water looks amazing. <laughs> there's some very impressive reflections there. Okay, did they already, they already saw me. Damn, I hate how it auto unsneaks you. Oh, he's poisoning me. And we're crashed. <clears throat> well, that's 1798 mods for you. Probably take about two minutes to reload here. Yeah, so the mod list is called Row, a graphics focused mod list, but, uh, yeah, it's it's a bit much. I'll probably do a mu uh, much higher performance one. But just maybe when we get the new graphics card, maybe it'll handle this mod list better. At least the performance part, not the crashing. I'd have to screw around with this. <laughs> Who knows how the hell you would troubleshoot 1800 mods for the uh, crashing issues. Have to pay somebody a salary <clears throat> to, to do that nonsense. Okay, so they already know I'm coming. So let's, whatever is making this buggy, let's see if we can get away from that. First, let's get buffs. Let's 
resave. Okay, we're fully buffed. Let's rock and roll. Oh, so this isn't even a bandit camp. Let's go, boy. You want a piece You've of this? Made a grave mistake. It's time to die, dog. You're nothing. I'll skin you alive. Too much? Oh. Well, so much for capturing. Uh. Oh, I guess I beheaded him. <laughs> Wasn't there some other pirates here trying to mess with me? It's a nice little setup he's got here. Almost feel bad. Ruining his little uh, shindig here. This would be a cool starting spot for like a fresh playthrough. With uh, some survival mods and such. Right, there's gotta be something in this boat. Skooma. That's some money right there. Ah, there we go. Oh. Not too shabby. Alright, what do we got down here? Jackpot. Uh... No, no. Can't see anything. Damn, I guess I can't cast them too far in the water. There we go. I guess he already got most of the good treasure out. That would make sense. Huh? Oh. Ooh, there we go. 68 gold. Okay. Uh, oh. Oh, no. Come on. Oh, jeez. should have saved it after I killed the pirate. That's okay. Apparently I have a major infection also. Alright, round two, pirate boy. You'll regret becoming a bandit. That's good, because I missed that chest, so that's cool. Oh. Did you do that? Okay, there's some weird stuff going on out here. <laughs> That's the guy we already killed. Okay. That's weird. Let's 
swear I'm missing a treasure chest. I mean, I know there's the ones in here, so I guess those are the ones I'm thinking of. Alright, this time we're not going to drown. Over 70 gold. Get that skooma. Treasure chest. And this time, just to be sure I don't do anything stupid. use water breathing the whole time. I could have took my time. But I think that's everything. That was the chest art. I already cleared that. Okay. Alright, so that's actually another quest in the books. So for that reason... Kill the leader of Ironback Hideout. I think that's where the guy escaped. How far could it be? There it is. I think that's where we gotta go. Alright, let's do it. Uh oh Okay, maybe we just need to find a different route. Huh? We're actually getting pretty close. Thank you. 
Who the hell are you? Oh, oh, why are you attacking me? Hey, I don't know you. Oh, I guess there was a wolf behind me. And it crashed. At least I saved after killing the pirate guy, I think. Wait, this infection is killing me. Let's let's go back to town. We gotta cure this infection anyway. Or wait, hold on. Do I have a potion? Injuries like that, maybe we should go back to town. Uh, I didn't find a travel pass, travel pack, whatever the hell you call it. Let's just go. I guess we're going to the iron back after all. Stuck. Great. COC iron back hold. COC iron back hold. Ugh.
All right. Collision did not fix it. Okay, hopefully our character is now unstuck. Is someone there? What the? Oh my god. I don't even know where I'm being hit from. Okay, first of all. Tough. You want a real fight, eh? Come on, you want the first, and you won't be the last. Is what you want? Ooh. Oh. Watch out, boys! I'll make you bleed. Killing you will make for an exhausting standstill. What the heck was killing me? Well, auto save. Sh uh. Oh, you're kidding? All right, whatever. God, 
what was that? Uh, that's a long word. Iron back, hide out, exterior zero one. So we'll do that, and then we'll quickly save it. We'll go from there. Okay. Oh, you want to go hand to hand, bud? Let's give this one more try. Not one more try. Let's. Uh, we'll just be careful. So delicious, I swear. Men aren't good or bad. A woman. Yeah, trying to keep some just music. like every night. Springtime. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Damn coward. You'll pay for this. Another day. 
What I kind of unarmed attack is that? Damn, he's two shotting me. Oh, and it's crashing again. Hear anything? Now ain't this a surprise? Now we're gonna have to spill your brains on the road here. for that? Ah, like the bite of a flea. <laughs> Already, bastard! I'll kill you! You're a fool to test me. Last mistake.
take me? Give up. Oh, no. You. You'll pay for that. Hey there. Brainstorming some story ideas in my head. Not sure if they're worth sharing yet. Right with you. Okay. That was a tough, tough battle. My god. Alright, let's see what else is in here. Probably got some treasure. stepped in something. Well, that's unfortunate. Hideout cellar. Did I miss you? Bandits shit in buckets because that's apparently a step up from what everyone else doesn't use. What? I don't understand what's going on here. So I need a key to access the cellar. Neither bandit's carrying a key. Did someone else die around here? This is annoying. So the key, there's no key to the cellar. I think there's probably a bug. Let me see if I can fix this. supposed to have access to that yet. That's fine.
Okay, so that was a legitimate cons legitimate. I legitimately cannot get to that. Actually, we should save it though. Okay, <clears throat> that's good though. We made a lot of progress. So, uh, <clears throat> collect bounty. So we did the executioner. We got the bounty. We got master's helmet. Pretty sure that's the vampire. We ain't messing with that. Um, we are gonna do the sh the warhorn to the shrine of Talos for her. Not right now. Okay. Cool. Now we just need to get our happy butts back to uh, solitude somehow. Quite up the mountain there. Oh my god. What is wrong with these bears? Absolutely out of control. Yeah, I'll leave the bears to you guys. Colorful. Certainly good to be back in solitude. Let's take a rest at the inn before continuing. Feeling sick? Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Oh, I still have the infection. Whoops. I must have not. Uh, whatever. King Skeever, next time your foot's sore. still injured. Injuries have healed. Much better. Ah, yes, the rain. Spare some gold for a veteran? Look at it. That's real Nord craftsmanship, that is. Let me show you an old trick I learned as a scout. Makes it harder for the enemy to notice you. Ah, oh, that's nice. Thank you. It's best you leave me be. 
Can you spare a septum? Lost an eye during the Great War. Oh, thank you. Divines, bless your kind heart. At least wear your helmet. mug around here somewhere. <clears throat> Isn't it weird how there's no fireplace? It's kind of annoying me. Seems there's no end to the needs of the Imperials. But what can I help you with? Return any time you need arms or armor. My forge never rests. Wanderer like you must have plenty of tales to tell. But I'm afraid I'm too busy to hear them. I got some fire. Take a look. already unlocked that ability. Alright, looks like we got some boots to upgrade. Very nice. Keep safe. And all need a weapon? Take a look. Business for the East. Got something for just about everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any questions. I hope the wilds claim you one of these days. I'm sorry, Come what? Back to bits and pieces. Good morning. What do you need? Trinkets, odds and ends. That sort of thing. She said the hopes the wild. Need something? Cleaning. 
Yes? Take a look. That was weird. Make sure to recommend us to your associates. I thought adventurers were supposed to look tough. Need something? Take a look. Let's see if we can't find an outfit that suits you. Finally. Spare some gold for a veteran? Hmm? out of me, you filthy sons of horkers. You wouldn't be a sellsword, would you? I have a little problem. That's a load off my mind. Here's your pay.
one. Ain't got one, but I'd fancy a chance at that Jari Ra's scrawny neck. You've been a good friend to me. That means something. I Keep your head about you. Books. You Imperial dogs will never break my will. Never! Sons of workers. I don't abide fancy clothes, but you look like you. The Empress cousin Vittoria Vici is getting married soon. The reception will be public. Anyone in solitude can attend. I stand with the Stormcloaks. You Imperial dogs will never break my will. Never! What do you need? Okay, just this once. You here for my next interrogation? I got nothing but time. Go away, go away, go away. Leave me be, Imperial. I ha don't think I don't know what's coming. It's only a matter of time before Atar's blade finds my neck. You want something from me? Y yes Hmm? You won't get anything out of me, you filthy sons of workers! I don't abide fancy clothes, but you look like... something Speak to Steer. He can help. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. 
The news is the same as it's been for the rest of the world. Any resident of Our solitude can here, tell you. But at the cost of Queen, guards of the after town's 20 own. years of fighting, I don't fighting, see any reason why we need them. As long as those dogs dead, stay outside of our borders, we're fine. Generals. If she returns to power, to the nobody could the stop her. The roads are beset by bandits and beasts, and now... Mm, oh, there's even luck. talk of bloody dragons. My dear... Bryling, barring any fancy and folly, the good people of Hafinger are surely capable of dealing with the odd highwayman or stray dog. Trouble on the roads and cities means less commerce. Less commerce means less money and more starving people. And that means more crime. Huh. That's only a problem for people who can't afford to hire their own security. That may well be our only answer. I will empower my steward to seek out capable individuals to secure Hafengar. Thank you, my thanes. Ha so, you wish to master the arcane arts? Vampires are clever hunters. More clever than you, definitely.
Right, I need to get into character. <clears throat> My blood's calm. I prefer it boiling. Uh-huh. I'm telling you, I heard it. Howling. Those werewolf tales are true. Eighty five hundred gold, that's what's up. Well, I don't know how much the uh, house costs in this town, but we're getting there. Although, we definitely have to start boosting uh, our spells up to get more powerful, too. I'd be a lot warmer and a lot happier with a lot of me. Wouldn't we all? You, you see, the, the college has been snooping around, Sarthoth. Got curved swords. Mages. Curved swords. No good can come of that. A welcome to I welcome you, friend. friend. How may I serve you? That is the creepiest kajit. Take a look.
May your old... Due to warm sands. We are creatures of the desert. Take a look. I hope that you will come to do business with us again. Kajit welcomes you. Well, you've come to the right place. May the sun keep you warm, even in this land of bitter cold. Couldn't ask for better weather. Ah, colorful. Where do you want to go? Climb and back, and we'll be off. Never been to White Run before? The Jarl's Palace is something to see. Dragon search, they call it. Big old dragon skull hanging on the wall. Brilliant. Yes, we're quartered in the hall of the... He... We bring his compassion where none can be found, by cleansing all those who would offend his children. None escape the vigil. All come into the light.
Enough. We've lost. We've stopped. What is it? Hold on, the Gagan. Stop talking now. Glad you're here in the city and not out in Riverwood. Those poor sods don't even have a wall. Got the fleetest steeds in all the sky. Take a look. Ride strong. Yes. Hmm? Need a horse? Take a look. Where do you want to go? Climb and back, and we'll be off. you can afford a septum or two. A coin or two for a veteran? It's not much to ask. Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. You look like someone who can hold their lick. Well, come back when you do, my friend. Come Welcome back to the when Winking Skeever. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Remember the Winking Skeever next time your foot's sore. Papa says I won't see Rob here anymore. But he wouldn't tell me why not. Need something? You were there for Rob Veer's execution. Thank you for helping my aunt earlier. I'll see you around. True, I may look the part of dashing swordsman, but I prefer the art my of My father wit was all the family I ever had. I felt so lost Good when evening. he died. 
but the crew of the Red Waves, my family now. I once captained a ship called the Argent. My shipmates scoff at my love of finery. But I know envy when I hear it. You've been a good friend to me. That means something. By blade or by spell. If you want it dead, I'll make it dead. All you need to do is pay my fee. Your typical solitude wi- A sharp mind beats- Oh, hello. Just tidying up. If you need me for anything, I'm all ears. Just remember to come back for me, okay? What's our next move? Okay, I'll just stop talking now. I used to think they called it the Blue Palace because it had an air of melancholy, but then I saw... If you have business, please see Falk Firebeard, my steward. Falk said I could count on you. You have more than earned the right to purchase property and take the next step to becoming a Thane. Speak to Falk when you have the funds, and thank you. There is room in my court for a new Thane. It's an honorary title, mainly, but there are a few perks someone like you could make use of. However, I could only grant the title to someone who is known throughout my hold, and who owns at least one piece of property in my city. You help my people and purchase a house from my steward, and I'll make you my thane. Good luck to you. Be well. Pray for solitude and my husband. Speak to Steer. He... Splendid. There's a house available right now. Very well. Just let me know when you have the necessary funds. Alright, that's a good checkpoint. We are much closer on our goal. We can now purchase the Proud Spire Manor, but we're 16,000 gold short. No big deal. We'll work our way up to it. Uh, let's just sell some items, do some enchanting, that sort of thing. Spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. Hmm. 
Hmm. I had you figured for a mage. I think you'll appreciate this. Take care of yourself, and always remember, the world is ripe with people looking to spill your blood. Steward, when is my appointment? There are some issues we must speak about. I'm afraid he's had to reschedule, my friend. By all accounts, waging war takes his every moment. Again? You can't simply cancel an appointment with a Jarl. He serves in my capital city. I'm afraid he can. His authority comes from the Emperor, who you also serve, technically. He uses all of Hathingar's resources. And doesn't answer to me in the slightest? This hardly seems fair. I'm afraid you must learn to accept this. As you know, Solitude's coffers are much depleted by the war efforts. Thane Erikur, you have a spot business. What do you suggest? This is an unfortunate but unavoidable ebb in revenue. Listen to you, speaking of sacrifice. The God. Hmm. I had you figured for a mage. I think you'll appreciate this. Take care of yourself and always remember that the, the world is right with people looking to spill your blood. With its own funds and without hijacking our supplies and soldiers, let Hathings are rebuilt. My lady. Good luck.
counting on you. Okay, so we're actually back at the uh, Bard quest for next time. Oh, just need money. Yes, very true. The mods look cool. I agree. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, that that'll be fun. One, I think the uh, the manor is pretty impressive. Is this it right here? No, that's one of the Thane's houses. That's the Bard's College, which is where we'll be progressing next time. I think we're just gonna sell some equipment and call it for the evening on the something? on the Skyrim front. So that'll be the house. You want something from me? Pretty nice property. Borders the uh, Bard's College here. Actually, it's a really weird spot. It's a lot of money for it. But you know what? Solid stone. I uh, guess it's in the wealthy district. Although, it's really weird. There's not a lot of houses in this city. But yeah, it looks pretty nice. I guess. <laughs> It'll be, not, it'll be better than paying for an inn every day, I guess. Sort of. Debatable. It's alright. It's one of the goals here. But yeah, you see a lot of the uh, Imperial influence here. Definitely notice that. Let's see what we can sell. We need to stock up on some more soul gems too. Let me know if you see anything you like. I hope your pep. Ah, so you're an alchemist then. She's been slacking. She has not been stocking up on her soul gems. Very disappointed. Don't forget me next. Ah, well. Ah, so you're an alchemist then. Thanks again for finding out about... Got something for just about everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any questions. Hello, I'm Gisley. But you can just call me Erica's sister. Everyone does. I hope the wilds claim you one of these days. I hope the wilds claim you one of these days. Why does she think that? What an evil merchant. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. I've done a lot of business with her. Why does she want me to die? Evil. Quite evil. Very evil thing to say. Take her out. Yeah, there's so few merchants in this town. I'm able to sell a lot of stuff to her, I would. I tell you what, maybe once I get the house. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, most stupid. Okay. Well, damn. Uh,. I don't have a lot to sell right now, I guess. I guess I sold most of... I'm going to hang on to this Ruby Dragon Claw. I probably don't need it because I already did the quest, but... Oh, right. Does she have any soul gems? See, she gets them in frequently, too. That's the other reason we need to keep her around. Come back to bits and pieces anytime. Broken ass NPC chat. Alright, so we've stocked up on gems. Soul gems, what we can buy. Um, I bet my papa could beat you up.
yeah, it's 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 uh, <laughs> yeah. Once we get a lot of these quest lines done, it's probably gonna get pretty chaotic here when I run out of things to do. Uh, luckily, we still got plenty of things to keep my character busy before he goes psychopathic. All right. Good story is nine parts truth and one so. Seems like most of these are nine parts fiction. Can we really just make things up? It doesn't oh, seem right. Read carefully. Oh, dear. You will see there are ways to stay true to the essence, Ildi. Alright, that is a good stopping point. So. Even while making parts up. Next time. We have quests. We have Tending the Flames for the Bard Guild. We have the Wolf Queen Awakens. We have the Jagged Crown with the Imperial line. So three nice quest lines should give us some good income and continue to progress some storylines. That's it. Yeah, thanks for coming out. Uh, hopefully the next one isn't me crashing to the desktop 50 times. Alright, catch you guys later.